Hello everybody, thanks for joining us today. Hope you had a wonderful 4th of July weekend. I'm Penny Stock Whispers and we're ready to get our week started with ERNI, that is the Rewards Nexus Incorporated. Last trading day was Monday, July 7th. We saw a previous close of 0 0.073 and we closed up last at 0.071. That was a decrease of 2.74% on a volume of 128,986 shares. There was a lot of potential for some uh, serious gains today though. ERNI did open at 0 0.068, saw a low of 0 0.063 and also a high of 0.07. So if you were able to catch it down there at the lows and you held on to it, you're in some really great shape. All of our indicators are telling me that ER and I is going to move big here pretty soon. So uh, let's go through them. We got our 14-day R size at 58.26. We are consolidating here, which is a pretty nice thing to see. I do like that. We are still in that 70 to 50 range. It's a strong buy accumulation range, and I'm very excited to see that. Should see a nice bounce here as well. You can see that our uh, our higher our lows have been getting aggressively higher. I'd like to see that continue on. This is definition of an uptrend. Uh, the 14 day RSI is looking really good here. Uh, I'm not concerned at all about that. It's actually looking pretty strong in my opinion. Down here on the daily chart, seeing something very similar here. Our parabolic SAR, these little red dots, are underneath our candlesticks. That's a very bullish indicator as well. And uh, we are about ready to see a crossover here with our 12 day EMA, about ready to cross over our 26 day EMA. We are seeing some strong support here as well, right uh, right there on our 50 day moving average. Let me pull this up for us. You can see we have a uh, health support right here. We did close above that which is always a good thing to see and I'm um, looking forward to see that uh, break out uh, it's gonna be pretty soon here we are pinched pretty closely here 0 0.08 looks like it's gonna be uh, or 0 0.07 7.2, I would definitely say, is probably our resistance line. Breaking through that, we're pretty clear all the way up till right around our 0 0.08 line here. I'm not seeing a little fine uh, decimal points for some reason. I uh, apologize for that. But uh, pretty easy right here. It looks like it's uh, very thin, very easy to move, not a lot of resistance. And once we do break through that 0.07, it should be pretty clear all the way up to 0 0.08. And once again, another big bracket after that. It's looking to me like we shouldn't see any more resistance until we get up to about the point, uh, you know, 12 cents area. So keep your eyes on that. Volume has been pretty nice here as well, uh, especially last week. I like to see this carry over into tomorrow and the rest of the week here. Accumulation has been on the rise. But I'm getting ahead of myself. That's a little bit further down. Down here on our MACDs, you can see that we are seeing something uh, pretty nice here. We did bounce off of our signal line, moving up to cross over that center line anytime now. Should be a really strong bullish play there. Histograms look very strong. We are getting some distance between our signal lines. Crossing over that zero line is going to be a big trigger for a lot of investors. It's a very bullish indicator. Down here on our trick line, seeing some uh, really nice things. Got two of them up for you. A 15 day and a 30 day. On our short term tricks here, you can see that we are fully, uh, fully moving here. We have crossed over that signal line not too long ago and we are moving up quickly towards that zero line very strong indeed this big change in direction right here is a very strong uh, indicator as well let me uh, indicate this right here yeah this little uh, change in direction is always a good thing to see this is always a good uh, you know indicator that we're gonna see a big reversal or a change in direction of our price so I'd like to see this uh, play off of our candlesticks here pretty soon tricks line very exciting just about ready to cross over its signal line this is a big deal indeed we are seeing that uh, that, uh, that, that change in direction as well. So in the long term, ERNI is looking very bullish as well. Slow stochastics looking very good. We are very bullish here as well. Looking at 82.22, we are slowing our descent, uh, ascent right here. So that's always got me excited. Very bullish region right now. Very strong. Uh, CCI doing a pretty healthy consolidation right here. We are pretty overextended. Uh, we're pretty overextended. Closing in a nice spot. That 148.37. I like to see this uh, move up nicely with the rest of our indicators here. Seeing something really nice with our stochastic RSI. Very strong. Very slow. Uh, gradual up towards uh, that point 0.8. We are in a great place right now with our 15-day, 14-day uh, moving average. We are between that point 0.8 and the point 0.5. Very nice thing to see. Starting to see a little bit of consolidation there in that 14-day RSI as well. Uh, it's at 0.949. Still got plenty of room to go here. Not concerned at all. I think this is going to continue to move up upwards of this indicator here. As you can see, we have been moving up, uh, making those higher lows. The definition of uptrend, always a good thing to see. Down here on our check and money flow, always uh, exciting to see this happen here. We had this crossover up into the positive region here. So this is always uh, something you want to keep your eyes on. We were trading underneath that for a while, which means we weren't trading very strongly. It wasn't a very good market to be trading in. But recently, ER and I has crossed over that zero line, and we're starting to see some big trades, some strong trades going in here. We've uh, officially you know, got rid of all those, uh, those flaky buyers, and it looks like we're starting to accumulate some really strong shares here. Down here on our ADX line, we have fully solidified an uptrend. You can see that our uh, ADX line itself is at 33.18, and our positive DI is above our negative DI, indicating that we are in an uptrend. And being above 25 lets us know that the ADX line is actually uh, fairly relevant here. PVO looking good as well. Uh, seeing some higher lows on this one as well. like to see this bounce off pretty soon here, start to move up. We are still above our signal line, looking pretty good. Money flow index also moving up. This is very good, 76.44 and climbing. 
Uh, accumulation distribution, this is where it's at. I'm very excited about this. You can see that we saw a uh, decline right here. We saw this uh, drop down right here. We got rid of all those flaky investors, and uh, we had a little bit of period here where we were just kind of moving steadily along, just you know, exchanging hands, uh, getting rid of all those people that weren't uh, going to hold on for long term here. ER and I starting to move up though. Got uh, some attention here. We're starting to move up. Big accumulation, big excitement from the from the you know the investors it's looking pretty good in my opinion on balance volume looking strong as well so er and i all in all looking very strong here accumulation on the rise lots of strong bullish indicators got a solidified uptrend forming with our adx line just crossed over on the, uh, the cmf and uh lots of uh you know higher lows here indicating that er and i is uh in, in an uptrend so very exciting thing. Keep your eyes on these tricks lines one more time. I want to point these out. Just that that uh, 30 day tricks has got me very excited. Crossovers of the signal line are very bullish uh, when it comes to the tricks lines here. So this change in direction combined with this crossover lets me know that we're going to see some movement here pretty soon. So keep your guys uh, locked on your eyes locked on this one. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Love to take a look at them. If you have any uh, you know anything else that you want to know about ER and I, you can sign up for our newsletter here at PennyStockWhispers.com. Just punch in your email address. We'd love to uh, be lovely to have you. Uh, we'll send all kinds of information to your inbox, and if you have an Android device, you can head on over to Google Play and search Penny Stock Whispers, download the app for your device, and uh, you'll get everything on the go. You can get everything from our, uh, our tweets to our videos and even the mailers themselves. So thank you guys again for watching. Keep your eyes on ER&I, and have a great night.